All right, this is going to be a quick tutorial on um, using the logo creator. Um, I'll have links where you can download it or whatever in the description. Um, to start, though, you just click any of these uh, logo sets. They've got a ton of pre-made um, logo templates, depending on what you need it for, if it's business or something just for fun. Um, like... If you scroll over it, it shows you a preview of it in the middle there. Um, that was the animated. There's business mascots. It's got little characters and stuff. Um, corporate edition. They've got a ton. There's a lot of logos on here or templates. Um, but yeah, just, just to show you how it works or whatever, you click on whichever one you want. They've got a lot more sets too. I didn't go through all of them or whatever, but um, this is your little text bar. It'll pop up. This is your logo, what it looks like right now. Um, you can change the background color of it if you want. <clears throat> um, for now, to edit any of this text, you just click on which one you want to edit and then click, click text. And then... I'll just put in my website name here and then click edit current text and it changed it now if you wanted to um, here I'll edit this too if you wanted to change this text anything about it the color the font um, any of that kind of stuff uh, click format. Well, click on the actual writing on any piece of the writing on that part. Just click on it and then click format. And then right here they've got um, what font style it is. So you can pick, you know, whatever you want out of here. Uh, I like that one. Okay, so once you pick it, it's going to change it. All right, and I got too big too, so now. Um, just click on it, format, and then scale. You just slide this scale to the left, and it'll make it smaller. You could do the same thing with this to this other uh, writing or whatever down here. Um, you could change the colors of any of this. Like if you want to change this background, let's. I'm gonna add an outline to this first, real quick. To add outlines, you just click on. Um, outline right here and then toggle on and off you got to turn it on and then I just usually keep it at a one and uh, we'll do black since the color is white I'm gonna change the background color right now to white and you just pick white hit done I should have did it to this too you just click on this writing down here click outline toggle on black and done Whoops, I should have changed it to one. Okay, there, so you got that. And then you can change, you know, if you wanted to change the color of this stuff. If you wanted to change the color of this or even move this stuff around, you can move it. Um, let's say I wanted to change that color. I don't know. Red or something yellow black and then just click done when you're done um, basically once you get everything how you want it you go up here to export you can save it too as like a project type thing or whatever or a template save it as a template but if you want to just export it to a JPEG or whatever to where you can upload it to your website or whatever just go to export and then JPEG full size is what I usually use. You could do GIF, you know, PNG, all that stuff. Um, JPEG full size. And then just name it whatever you want and hit save. And then you can go in and get it. Um, yeah, so that's just a short, uh, short little beginner guide to uh, the logo creator. 
version 5. Um, I'll get a link in the description to where you can download it or I'll just put it on my website and go to that and get it. But, all right, thanks for watching. Peace.